Morning guys, check it out. This is the first time this landy is going in for a roadworthy check, so I'm quite keen to see what comes out of that. So far it's been four years now since it left Factory Fresh, uh, arrived at our place Factory Fresh. And what has gone wrong? Nothing. Zero zip. Which has been quite impressive for a landy in my experience anyway. Don't know about you guys out there. Um, the only thing that did go wrong, obviously, was the, the red light cave staying on when you unlock the car, but that was the battery on the key fob, which you guys helped me out with, and that was the, uh, the, uh, the fix, if, that, if you could put it that way. What else happened is the, the aerial broke off. That was me. <laughs> Putting it through the car wash. I forgot to put it down. It snapped clean off, so we replaced it, and it still works fine. Um, besides that, the only thing that is worn out is the, uh, the mat for the driver uh, seat, the mat on the floor, the floor mat, that's completely gone. That's like a plastic little coating thing, um, yeah, what do we do with that, we just leave it as it is. The rest is worn pretty well, the leather seats always wear very well. Carpeting in the back don't take much abuse either, and it's... Um, actually held up very well. Nothing wrong, nothing to speak of. No oil leaks either. I'm going to have a quick look underneath when he puts it on the ramp just so we can have a look underneath there. But I think it's going to be just fine. Emission test. Oh, that looks green to me. Well, that looks pretty good to me. Oh, well, look at that. There is a bit of grease there on the swivels. The brake pads are nearly done. We need a bit of greasing in here. Wait. The graissage, no man? Wait, wait. This hair has not been tightened correctly, so it's turning. Yes. Burnt out, it seems. But well, well, there you have it, man. It came straight through the roadworthy flying colors. The only note was the front little marker lights, which have blown on both sides, which I need to replace the, uh, the light bulbs. Okay, is that a big thing? I don't think so. And the hockey sticks in front, those joints, those um, I'm not sure what they're called, those are wearing out because the suspension is so stiff. So it's actually a design. Not a design flaw, but something not that cool. That's something you need to think of because the suspension on this latest 110s are so hard. Any little road and um, traffic comfort you take, you really notice. So you need to be aware of it, you know, as you drive along. And the front brake pads are wearing out a little bit. After 85,000, I am not complaining, obviously. So, well, there you go. Hope you enjoyed this little uh, glimpse of what a Landy 110 is like after four years and its first roadworthy test. Thumbs up for me. Uh, catch you on the next one, guys, and keep rolling.